Hey guys, this is Alan over at Sonic Electronics. This is just a quick tip while you might be in the middle of your installation. Um, sometimes I found that uh, some of the wiring diagrams that are out there um, aren't always correct as, in terms of polarity on speakers. Sometimes the wire colors are incorrect. Um, obviously, if you're running your own new speaker wire um, it, to your speaker, you'll obviously know which color uh, you know, wire you're using for, for polarity for positive and negative. But if you're just utilizing the factory uh, cable that's in the door, um, on a vehicle, sometimes you need to know. So what we kind of just did here, is just as a quick tip, is I uh, went ahead and cut off the connector. This is the factory speaker. Um, and this is just a little um, pack uh, speaker tone generator. And um, you, can, you can do it with something, a device like this, or just a simple nine volt battery. But uh, essentially what we're looking for is we want to make sure the speaker pops outwards so we can check polarity. So we know this is obviously positive. This is obviously negative because it's red and black coming from this device here. So we can see the speakers popping outwards and that tells us that our green wire is positive, our blue wire is negative. What you'll see what will happen if you flip them around and we connect positive to the blue wire and negative to the green wire, the cone pops inwards and that's not what we want. So to figure that out, even with the nine volt battery, it's just basically doing the same thing. Uh, you're just going to flip it around till you get the cone popping outwards and uh, seeing which, um, which speaker color is on positive and negative. So that's just a quick easy tip. Um, if you can't find the documentation on the polarity of the speaker or the colors are wrong, obviously like I said if, you, uh, if you've done maybe a car many times over you may know them by heart. Um, this is just kind of a, a quick easy tip if you can't find something. A lot of people have a 9 volt battery laying around. Um, or they might even have a tone generator that allows you to pop it. Um, and that way you can make sure all your speaker polarity is correct. So that way when you install your new speakers, they sound uh, as good as they can. So just a quick tip from Alan at Sonic Electronics.